And if you guys don't know Lizzie, she has been in my past videos and like really, really past videos. Yeah. Before the channel was the Heart Rockets, she was there. So go check out videos with her and she's so cute. I'm not saying you're not cute now, but um, anyway, welcome to the channel. So you guys know the drill, subscribe, hit that bell, all of that stuff. Um, this is going to be a longer video because of the type of video we're doing. We're yes. doing the never have I ever challenge. Okay, so we are on day seven, which I don't want to do today because it's embarrassing. Mary doesn't understand how she can have a baby without being married, but the angel Gabriel assures her of great truth. Nothing is impossible with God. Be creative. Use your talents wherever they are to create something that represents the story of birth of Jesus, like a Christmas ornament, a painting, a wrap, or a short play. Ugh, guys, okay, so we can't paint right now. <laughs> we can't exactly put it on a plane right now, and we also can't make an ornament right now, so that means we have to wrap. Um, we need to get some wrapping paper so we can wrap some Christmas gifts. I don't think that's what they meant. Are you sure? Yeah. I'm pretty sure that's what they mean. Uh, wrapping, like, wrapping gifts for Christmas? No. Are you sure? I think it's rapping like the song style. Well, I can't rap. All right, moving on. So the challenge we're doing today is the Never Have I Ever Challenge. And on our cards, we have I have and I have not. So we have a little, a little thing that says have faith, a little box. And we're going to shake it up and take turns taking them out and reading them. And if we have done this thing, Christmas related, we are going to put I have. And if we have not, we are going to put I have not. And we will each tell you why we have or have not done it. Christmas themed questions. So you ready to play rock, paper, scissors to see who goes first? Yeah. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. All right, Liz, you get to go first. They're all Christmas themed. Liz, my parents, and I all came up with them, so. Never have I ever gotten a terrible um, white elephant gift. <laughs> so if you guys don't know, I know some places in the world they don't do white elephants. So white elephant is where you like go to a party and you bring a gift that could be for either a boy or a girl and you put it in a circle with other gifts and you normally you like play a game where you like turn, uh, twist them around, like pass them back and forth, and then you open the gift you get. So you get a random gift, and a lot of times they're not great gifts. Yeah, it's like neutrals, like for boys and girls. All right, so our answers? Um, my... All right, so I have, um, we did a white elephant Christmas party for a light group we were in, and I got a beach ball. Oh. The Christmas season, and I got a blow up beach ball from the Dollar Tree. I did not like that gift. Um, I haven't really done it. I only did it with our grandparents, and I got um, pretzel sticks covered in chocolate with toffee on top, so it was really good. She got a really good one! Uh, wait, no, wait. Oh, that white elephant gift. No, that was good. I got a mug. I liked that. Okay. My turn. Okay. Never have I ever bought a gift for somebody. Okay, that one's easy. Oh, um, I have! I spent our parents' money, but I think I bought a gift. Oh yeah, I did um, for someone's birthday. Yeah, um, I have given a lot of gifts. So. Honestly, everybody should have bought a gift for somebody at some point. Though. Never have I ever um, done a white elephant. <laughs> oh, okay. I have. <laughs> Same. I've done like three. I don't like them, <laughs> but I've done them. I did it once. Yeah. Never have I ever, ever everything I wanted. Okay. Never have I ever got everything I wanted for Christmas. So is, has there ever been a year where you got every single thing you wanted for Christmas? Yes. Mm -hmm. um, the year we moved to our new state, I went back to my old town for Christmas at my grandparents and I really, 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 really wanted Shopkins. I really, really wanted the Nerdy Nummies cookbook and I got 
and the Cake Boss cookbook, and I got all three of those plus a phone, which I wasn't expecting a phone, so I got even more than I wanted, so definitely. Um, usually when I write my Christmas lists, um, I get everything. Or if there's something you don't get, you buy it later with Christmas money. Yeah, because so. we get Christmas Mm-hmm. We're very um, blessed to have all of the stuff we have because yes. we understand that a lot of people do not. Never have I ever done Secret Santa. <laughs> I have, um, for our youth group, one time we had to bring, no, not youth group. No! Wait, <laughs> no, wait, no, 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 I'm thinking I of a white elephant. Thing. I'm thinking of a white elephant. Um, I haven't. Um, yes, you have. Wait, yeah. We used to do this with our cousins, where we would draw a cousin's name and we'd have to buy a gift for them. And most of the time our parents would buy the gifts for us. For our oh, yeah. But, um... When I started getting older, I started buying the gifts for people, but now we don't do it anymore. We just stopped doing it for some reason. So, yeah, so I have, but I have it recently. So, yeah, we were forgetful. There's 10 of these, by the way. Never have I ever pretended to like a gift that was actually terrible. <laughs> and, <laughs> yeah, um... Uh -huh. Most of the gifts are my grandma and grandpa that are my mom's parents because they don't really know us that well and they don't really know what we like. And most of the year it's just some like girly makeup set or like kids makeup set or like a girly like kids nail polish Yeah, like set. recently, um, like last Christmas I think, we um, both got the same thing. It and was a um, Princess Belle nail polish set. And um, it's the thought that counts, but yeah. um, we didn't like it, but we had to pretend we did. And there's been a lot more gifts we haven't liked that we've had to pretend to like. So. Yeah, but it's the thought that counts. Yeah, so. Yeah. <laughs> well, I feel like I just exposed myself. <laughs> Never have I ever um, regret a gift I got before. Regifted. Oh, okay. Regifted. So have you ever gotten a gift and then wrapped it back up and sent it to somebody else after? Yeah, um, so there was this cat stuffed animal I got and I loved and I gave it to her because she wanted it, but that doesn't really count, I oh, guess. Yeah. Um, but what does is, um, Autumn probably doesn't know this, but um, so Spilling the tea. Autumn FaceTimed me and she's like, I have like seven gifts for you oh. and they're all awesome. And I was like, oh my gosh, I only have two gifts for her. What am I going to do? And I like, I went to the store and bought gifts. I went through my room to get gifts. And I found the stuffed animal that she liked of mine that she's always loved. So I wrapped it back up and gave it to her. Um, and I may or may not have told her that I bought it for her. And there's also been times where I got little gifts for my birthday. And I never used them. And they still have, like, their tags and stuff. So I just re-gift them to people. Um, so. Because it looks new, they won't know the difference. So what, um, so my answer is I have, and basically, um, um, our, my friend Rain, she, um, so, um, after Christmas with her grandparents when I got the nail polish set, I didn't really want it because, um, they've already had it, <laughs> so I decided to give it to her because she likes nail, she likes nail polish more than me at the time, so. And we didn't exactly tell her that. We were just like, I got this, and I'm not a huge fan. You want it? Not like, oh. Yeah, she, I guess she kind of knew then, huh? Probably. So it's my turn. We also got them other Christmas gifts. That wasn't yeah. all they got from us. Um, never have I ever tried peppermint bark. Okay? And? Right? No, no. I've never tried peppermint bark. I've tried like white chocolate stuff, but that is a yeah. Count. I've never like, tried like actual peppermint bark because I don't like chocolate and it's dark chocolate and peppermint. So I had the peppermint white chocolate bark thing, but not peppermint bark. Yeah, yeah. I've never tried it. Maybe need to. People say it's good. Um, there's two. What? Is it the same question on those cards? Yes. Okay. Never have I ever um, um, peeked at a Christmas gift. Shh. 
same. Well, basically, I like um, looked at little holes in it. I never like unwrapped it and looked at it. Like I looked at like small pieces of red stuff. <laughs> What's your I'm thing? exposing myself. Ah, okay. <laughs> I, I'm gonna flip over the gift, the side that didn't have my name on it, and I'd like rip a square or something <laughs> into it, and I would look at what it was, like read the description on it, and then I would put the paper back on it and tape it again, and my, so my mom wouldn't find out. Um, she caught me one time, and I told her I would never do it again, and I did it every year after that. Oh, wow. Um, I haven't done it in, since we've lived in this house, so... Yeah, but I used to do it all the time and she's watching me! <laughs> but yeah. She's in the other room. One more! So our parents didn't let us stay up late and so we were never allowed to stay up and see. Yeah. So, and yeah, and we were, we, our parents told us about Santa when we were younger, so we haven't had any to do that since then. So, yeah. Um. Now we have the thought calendar, if you would grab that, Liz. Um, I'm a model. And I know I did it yesterday, so I shouldn't be doing it today, but Liz wanted to open it with me. So yeah. let's see, this is it's day four. I could have held it, I can hold it while you do it. Pull them out. That is would that? be them, yes. Oh, okay. Okay, so they are Hufflepuff. Hufflepuff! I'm a Hufflepuff. What are you? I'm a Hufflepuff. Oh, you are. Yes. <laughs> if I get a second pair of Hufflepuff socks, you can have them. But these are these are my favorite type of socks. They're low cut socks, which this is my first pair of low cut socks. I'm very happy about that. But yeah, this is what they look like. But yeah, I'm a Hufflepuff. So proud to be, put the other one on. Proud to be a Hufflepuff. I'm already wearing socks. We can be Hufflepuff sisters. <laughs> wow. Hufflepuff <laughs> sisters. Okay. Anyway, now we're going to do the quote. Do you want to read it or do you want me to read it? Sometimes they're kind of hard to read. Okay. Which one are we on? I did that one. I did this one. Which one are we on? This video is the longest video I filmed since the, I started. Okay. Change your life today. Don't gamble on the future. Act now without delay. Simone de Bior, be Bevour. Again, it's up on the screen like it always is. So you guys can read it. Check that quote out. I think it's pretty cool. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching this video. And we'll see you guys in the next... Well, I'll see you guys in tomorrow's video. I'm going to try to get her to do more videos with me because she should. She's funny. So, yeah. Guys. <laughs>